Japrit said, just finished watching your American Indian series. Really enjoyed it. Well, hey, thank you, sir. Awesome. Appreciate it. And we'll actually, we like, we... surprised who actually have seen some of this stuff. So, yeah, um, last night. This. We're very proud of them. Yeah, last night we ran into somebody and, and uh, they'd actually been watched. They, I mean, they'd seen some of what we did when we were in India. And they're like, yeah. So you just never know. And it's funny. They're like, we're not stalking you or anything. We're like, no, please. No, please stalk us. Like, watch our videos. Please. No, please. We're begging for views. stalkers. Please. That could almost be like a video. It's just like, it's like the, the stalker pleader. You know, in, in the in the old movies, like the stalker, you know, who goes after the big celebrity star, mm -hmm. baseball player, whatever. Well, and this is the baseball player who looks for people to stalk him. Come on. Like, hey. Hey. Hey, watch my videos. Aren't you, hey. aren't you hey, a fan of YouTube? Uh, uh, watch my videos. <laughs> I, I, I got a channel. No, that <laughs> it's like, it looks like, it looks like the guy is like Ted Bundy, you know, like a serial killer. But really all it is is like, click subscribe, honey. Like, that's it. That's a good video. No, right that would be kind of hilarious. We should make that. You know, once again, we we have all sorts of great ideas. Probable um, one says the heat is already deadly over there. No, I think about that. I've been seeing some Instagram posts, like already triple digits worth of heat. I'm like American triple digits. So not fun. it's been a weird year for us, though. We've uh, every time it starts to warm up, cools we down get a the cold next snap, week. We just right? get this so little like, cold front. Tonight is pretty cool right now so it's nice like we've only been hitting okay Whew, guys you're making me try to do my conversions conversions because we've only been hitting mid 70 degrees over here 28 degrees celsius or something like that so it's been super nice actually and that is one thing i've I, it's funny every once in a while i think about that i'm like i don't miss the heat like i don't miss that like right now you're just miserable trying to go to sleep in india with if, if you don't have air conditioning and I don't miss the mosquitoes. The mosquitoes buzzing in your ear when you're trying to sleep. Like, I don't miss that. Now, the only thing about the weather, uh, India has gotten into my bloodstream, truly. <sighs> 18 months later, I still get so cold. Like, I'll surf for 20 minutes without a wetsuit. And the water is still, and we're in April, it's still chilly. And I'll be like 20 minutes, my teeth are literally chattering. I'm like... <laughs> It's just I have yeah. not recovered. No, so. it's true. So, so I'll be at work because I, I, so I'm working. She wears a sweatshirt. Like it's I like... have a long sleeve shirt and a sweatshirt. Everyone else is like showing up in their bathing suits to go out on boats, right. and I'm like, <laughs> like no, uh, uh. Indians She's are in shorts, be. and she's and wearing. And I'm you know. still got my sweatshirt on. Um. So both places, people said something about the cell. I don't know. Oh man, you are right. I really need to watch that movie. So I love that director. My brain's dead. The Fall. The Fall. Oh, so this is the same guy who did the Fall. Yes, the that guy, guy is a cell. genius. Tarsum. Yeah, um, so really he good. is indigenously Indian. Uh, what is his background? I'm not really sure his ethnic background. No, I think he's from. Um, why did he's I Punjabi. He's... Tarsum Singh oh. Dandwar, uh, known professionally as Tarsum. Indian American director. Oh, oh, I was trying to put him down from South America. That's so weird. Why was I trying to no. do that? A freaking genius. Uh, the Fall features one of my favorite sequences in cinema history. Uh, I should really see the cell. I know the visuals. No, that guy. No, it's beautiful. The visuals beautiful. are amazing. And one of the most, ah, like, I don't even know how to put it into words, but it's just like one of the most trippy peering through the curtain of reality We should secret, probably rewatch some of that and talk about it on Building a Better Me. Oh. Because I mean, really, well, it, was like, it actually really ties in well with kind of mental health. Actually, you're right. Building it, you know, that movie fits all three things. The Fall may be the most creative, cross-cultural, and constructive film I can think of. Because cross-cultural is very interesting because you've got this actor who's telling a story, and he's saying... In, in his story, he's saying there was this Indian and this girl who's from, what, like Eastern Europe or, mm -hmm. or like Russian er, Russia area. Like she she speaks English, but, you know, you can tell by her accent that she's a new immigrant child. And so the way she interprets it, that's why I love, oh, my gosh, that book, movie is so good. Talk about cross-cultural communication. So he's saying Indian. He means Native American. And she, she interprets a Sikh. Yes. I believe. Mm -hmm. I think it's a I'm Sikh. I'm pretty sure it's a Sikh. When she falls... One of the most crazy things you'll ever see in a movie. I get chills just thinking about that sequence. That's my, in my opinion, the best bit of editing. Uh, like if music videos were made like that, then all music videos would be amazing. Yes, good, good call. I need mm -hmm. to. So I'm, I'm gonna have a, uh, a watch list. 
Oh yeah, we need to rewatch the fall. Come on. Yeah. Maybe we should maybe me and Cole should do a Tarsum film marathon. Hey, the Cell, The Fall, yeah. Immortals, Mirror Mirror, Selfless. Yes. You know, I don't even know. care how bad the other three are. I don't care. Like it's the dude has earned it. I was at Mumbai with viral fever this day four years ago. Wow. And so the first video, I was like, I would like to watch a video. The first video that popped in my head today, like, you know, when we talk about that, was their social experiment video. I just went back and watched some of it. That is br brilliant. Capital B, brilliant. The fact that social experiments still exist after this video is testament just to how dumb we are as human beings. Uh, TBF here. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to link that one. We won't watch it, but this is the best social experiment parody ever like it's just it's so refreshing you know i'll put it in both chats definitely check that out put that in your links go rewatch that one it's so worth that's my theory on that a couple other things in the youtube chat i'd love to see satya and rohan celebrate raksha pandan when is it i don't know it's uh typically in uh, in august i believe we have a hard time at this point keeping up with our family's birthdays and holidays uh so we have a birthday today, actually. So we're, we're going to be running around for that. It's like birthdays, anniversaries. Um, well, all their birthdays just happen to fall like right in a row, right in this first part of the year, which you're still like trying to recover from holiday season. So it's really just I don't know. This past year, I've been so over the holidays and over the birthdays. I'm like I'm just I don't have the energy or the brain power to deal with it. Uh, check out Travel Vlog. IV channel. She is a Dutch residing in India and Bangalore. Her vlogs Aww. reminded me of when you were residing in Delhi. Check out her vlogs on Indian food. Oh, I can tell you right now I'm not going it's, it's to. Too, too it's soon. too It hurts too much. It's too soon. We just feel it's jealous. It's too soon. I feel jealous and I feel sad. And resentful. And resentful and bitter. And we're mean. And so it brings like. Brings out the worst of us. I'm so glad that you can yeah. enjoy them. By all means, and, watch her. Please watch them. But like. Yeah. I can just tell you support right now I'm not her. going to. That, that's good. Because you know, yes. Go support channel, her. Channel that support you've given to us to her. So yeah. that'd be cool. Because it hurts too much for me. Uh. इंडिया की चिलचिलाती धूप में अपना स्किन टोन खराब करने के बाद मुझे एहसास हुआ कि इलेक्शन के बाद किसी नेता को पकड़ पाना मुश्किल ही नहीं नामुमकिन पर एक दिन टहलते हुए मुझे मिल ही गया एक सुरा बिल्कुल ताजा ब्लैक मनी सुगंध तो ब्लैक मनी जैसी है स्वाद भी ब्लैक मनी जैसा है ये बिल्कुल ताजा ब्लैक मनी है मतलब जरूर कोई पॉलिटिशियन आसपास है चलो उस तरफ माइकल सुनते सुनते मैं पहुंच गया हूं पंद्रह पुतिन पर ओके दिस लाइन आई डिट नोटिस इट बिफोर बट लिस्ट टू वी सेज लिस्ट टू वी वो देखो माइकल उधर उधर ओ ये कितना सुंदर दृश्य है अपने चमचों कर्जियों के बीच बैठा ये खतरनाक जंतु है बाहुबली का क्रिमिनल हो ये प्रजाति अपनी अवैध गतिविधियों और हिंसक प्रवृत्ति के लिए जानी जाती है you know, I don't know if they do all of them like this, but this was pretty much a team effort. So Amit, who's playing the uh, Bahubalikas Criminalo. Uh, him. What's the, the skinny guy's name? Misra. Uh, I can't I can't remember his first name right now. I think Bissell was was working on something else. I know he, he worked. No, I think all of them. Wrote, so everyone kind of came in with a different idea. The, the writing process was very interesting. It was much more like the writing process for what a TV show is, like a boardroom. Except... We just sat on the floor and stayed up all night. I don't think I contributed very much at all. The puns, that they came up with so many cross-language puns. I mean, this is just, ah, oh, man. They really are good. This was good times. It was a lot. It was a fun shoot. Probably one of the funnest shoots I've ever been on. It's good stuff. Good memories. Deepak. Yes, Deepak Mistra. That's him. Um, so they all came up with their own kind of little, little parts. So good. So good. Good job, TVF. Good job, TVF. Shabash. Wah, yeah. wah. Wah, wah. So yeah, if, if anybody's interested in doing an interview, because we are going to kind of transition out of the way we've been doing India Connection videos mm -hmm. into, into just the interviews. interviews. I think that'll be more sustainable. For the and first, it's something we're really interested yeah. in too. For the first one, I'm, uh, I just did the edited version. Uh, I just don't know if I'm going to be able to sustain that either because you have to do the interview and then you have to watch the interview and then you have to edit it. And that's just like, Three hours. I really need this to get down to one hour. Um, we, we'll probably go through some again growing pains of it mm -hmm. not being that great at first, uh, but we can you know stumble along through it together. I think mm -hmm. I think the end goal would be to interview you know movers and shaker Indians um, as well as every man's like all of us uh, and get that spectrum. Yeah. Um, you know, eventually I'd love to be able to interview some of these like 
uh, you know, people I follow on Twitter. There's Neeraj K. Agarwal. He's a big Bitcoin guy, uh, just real smart. And then this other guy, uh, Balaji Srinivasan. And uh, the main dude, I, my mind's blanking on him right now. But again, these guys are, are great entrepreneurial Silicon Valley dudes because there's such a range of experience. You know, you've got NRIs. Um, You've got second generation Indians living overseas. You've got Indians in India. Um, right now, the focus is on Indians living in India, and we want to always keep that as part of it. So, yeah, Abit mentions the Arnab controversies and what happened. Um, oh, geez, I don't want to talk about that crap. Um, I mean, it hit one of the YouTubers I started off with. I met him at a shoot here in Panama City. And not long after that shoot, he became famous. Yeah, he became a big time YouTuber, Toby Turner. Uh, aka Tobuscus, and then you know allegations came out. Me too. Allegations came out, and uh, his ex girlfriend uh, and Philip DeFranco kind of stood up for him in a way. Say this guy's an a hole, but he's not a rapist, and um, and they they're convinced that they didn't believe the allegations. But it's enough to tank someone's career. That's all it takes is just one person saying, uh, you know, even in America. And so again, like you start, there is this. There's this tendency all over the world to try to overcorrect from one problem, but the problem is when you overcorrect from one, you never acknowledge that even under the social problems of that culture, the opposite has been going on all along. They're not just bad men. There are bad women. Ba bad women did not just start existing last week. There have been bad women since the beginning of time, and bad women existed in bad systems. And the tendency is to say, oh, well, just blame it on the system. Like, they wouldn't be bad if the system weren't in place. Wrong. Not true. There are good people that exist in bad systems. Uh, and so then what happens when you go all the way over to the other side, that enables all of the very bad people who were oppressed under that system to come out of the woodwork and become even worse. Um, and the French Revolution is a good example of that. Mm -hmm. uh, you know, the, with the, yeah. the overthrowing the Russia with the czar and everything. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, yeah, they're not going to do anything. And then yeah. they just kill the children. Right. So it was know? interesting like, because okay. we, we've been watching Downton Abbey. So one of the characters in Downton Abbey is Irish, and he's very political and very socialist. And so he's he's like kind of paying attention to what's going on in Russia, and he's like, you know, they've they've kind of taken over and they've put the czar and his family away, but they won't kill them. And so it's interesting, you know, because it, it was interesting to see his progression, because he's like, oh, I'm I'm all 100 percent socialist. Like this is a good thing that's going to happen in Russia, but they won't kill him. And then oh. he finds out that they killed the czar and his all his kids. And it was so interesting, like, he still justified he's it. He still justified Because he, he, oh, well. you could tell, like, before, like, he didn't, he really didn't think they were going to do it. it. Forced him to cross a line for socialism. Yeah. Right? Because he was still going to hold on so strongly to socialism that it was going to force him to cross a moral boundary that he had set right. for himself. That, no, okay, you know, it was okay for them to kill the czar and his children for socialism, for the greater good, you know, where he was definitely on this side of it. And then he stepped over that line. So it, I don't know, you know, like that, that happens all the time, right? Yeah. People think for the greater good and for their cause. And that cr makes them cross lines that they know that they shouldn't morally as a human being. And that's, I think that's our purpose with the building a better me thing is not to search for a cause, but to search for building a better me is something that's objectively better for me, for Indians, for yeah people of color, the whole world, for men, for women, not not just no, for it's, one it's thing. It's a human. Like, it's a human individual responsibility. Right. You're a human being. Pick up your mantle of personal responsibility right. and get your act together. Oh, women are people too. Bad and good exist in us too. Oh, we have a woman in the stream. That's, that's me. I, I always assume they're all dudes. I mean, my, my demographic, I'm not being we, sexist. No. It's just my demographic is sexist. Like it's YouTube literally 85% male. 85% so, of our viewers and are I male. And I assume, so the, just assume the, other, is. the other three are literally my mom. So. And Kara. <laughs> and Kara, my, my uh, adopted sister. <laughs> <laughs> so I don't have many women we in the We don't have many female viewers. Uh, so Hurrah, welcome, welcome. Welcome. Yes, you're welcome. Uh, treat her with respect, gentlemen, please. Oh, that's right, because I did get on a B6 who is not with us. <laughs> yeah, he was hitting on uh, Kara was, that one time. He was totally, no, and this other girl, he was totally trying to get her number. I'm like, leave her alone. I, I think went, he's kind of joking. Went, you know, come on, it's a little, you know, okay, I won't I make the justification. On him. Uh, she did go auntie on him. Thank you, everyone. All right, Godspeed, y'all. We will see you on the other side. Until next time, keep it creative, cross-cultural, constructive. Stay glorious. Stay beautiful. <laughs> stay strong. Stay, stay glorious. Stay strong. Keep going. And if you can't do that, just hold on.